Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Hope you're doing well. So Gemini, this reading will be for you if you have any Gemini placements or if you're dealing with a Gemini. I hope you're all in good spirits. So today I will be doing a general reading and a love reading for you guys. All right. So let's get straight into it. Yeah. Um, your first, well, your angel numbers message for today is 463. So I just look like that because that number keeps stalking me. That number is following me. It's, mm, anyways, your angels are at some of you guys. You may be seeing 46, 63, 43. 60, yeah, okay, okay. Your angels are encouraging you to do all you can to love and care for your body. This will clear the road ahead. That's funny because in your last reading, I did pick up on somebody having some foot surgery or some, or some kind of... Um, something like that but some of you guys let's just say overall healing in some kind of way okay i want to say i want to say um for those who uh resonate with that where your body's healing even if it's healing from trauma okay and things like that please keep pos a positive mindset okay every day i am healing tomorrow i will be much better than, uh, than today okay today i'm improving keep that positive mindset okay look at all the um really do that because that helps as well okay okay all right so uh general first and then love all right guys so i'm gonna pick this i'll do this deck so gemini what messages do we have for gemini today what messages do we have for gemini today please you should let me love you. Um, what's his name? Uh, what's his name? Um, Ma Mario. If you didn't hear that song about 10, 15 years ago, playing on the radio all the time, I don't know where you was. Mario, you should let me love you. I just heard that someone wants to take care of you, look, look after you. This could also be you with somebody, Gemini. Someone wants to give you everything you want and need. Oh, somebody really wants to really support you and be there for you in each and every way, okay? Whether that is um, a partner, someone that, that loves you, someone that cares about you, okay? All right, so it doesn't have to be a romantic thing. It could be a family member who really wants to take care of you or, or, or show you how much they appreciate you, all right? So let's get into the general message. What message do we have for Gemini today, please? So if you guys are wearing crystals around your neck or your bike, you're looking online for a crystal uh, pendant uh, necklace. So if you guys, um, you could have been manifesting with them during the full moon. During the full moon, okay? All right. Gemini, Gemini, general, please. The fool, risk taking, taking a leap of faith, wanting to start something new. You could be taking a journey also. Could be connecting with an Aries. Fresh start, a fresh slate. No holding me back. You're not listening, you're not hearing. You're not hearing any, any kind of negativity pulling you back from what you are meant to be doing for yourself. You know what I just got? Some of you guys, um, not for all of you, but for some of you guys, I literally just got someone walking on a mission. They're on a mission. They're determined and people say... You'll never make it. Like the shouting loads of negative things. You won't make it. You won't do it. And you're like, yes, I will. Yes, I will. And you're walking. And the further you walk, the less you hear those voices. For some of you guys, it's a voice from a parent, a voice from people around you, at school, in your neighbourhood. Things that people say to you, the more you walk forward, the less you hear those noises, those voices. The more you walk forward towards your path, towards the direction that is calling you, the less you hear that noise. 
All right. Thank you. The chariot of the ace of cups. That's you moving forward. That's you saying, yeah, I've made up my mind. I'm following through. That's where I'm heading. For some of you guys, it could be in regards to a relationship, okay? Or something that you fall in love with, okay? Something that you love. I'm also getting... For some of you, there's... For some of you, there's someone or people... I don't know, for some of you guys, it'll be different. It'll be one person, two people, a group of people. A community that is going to open you with welcome arms, Okay? And I'm also seeing somebody saying, if you need any help, if you need anything, just let me know. You've, you're walking towards something and you're being greeted in such a lovely way. You're being, you're being welcomed. I can't remember the last, what the last reading I said for you, uh, did for you, Gemini. I don't know what you're doing, but you're going towards the right place. Where you're not just being tolerated, you're being welcomed and you're be and you're appreciated. There's a shift in energy. There's a shift in things, things that you're hearing, things that you're experiencing. Or there will be some of you guys. It's happening now. Some of you guys are is in the near future. Okay. Death card and the Queen of Pentacles. So you're transforming. You're moving forward. Some of you guys are changing a job. Okay, changing your career, something, some kind of change there. It's something to do with your career for some of you guys. A, a life path, a, something that you're meant to achieve. You, you know what? I, the energy today is... Feeling extremely determined. I did Taurus earlier. And even in your reading today, Gemini, I'm getting this energy of, I'm not going to give up. And I love that. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay. Two of Swords and the Star. You're want, you're, some of you guys are trying to um, figure out if that's what you truly want. Some of you guys are trying to figure out if you want to be in the spotlight. If, if you want to be in front of the camera or, like, behind the scenes in regards to something. Some of you guys have a decision to make about an Aquarius as well. Some of you guys, it's something to do with responsibility also. There's more responsibility coming your way, but not in a way, some, not something that you can't handle. It's not something that you can't handle. You're more than ready. Six of Wands is somebody who's more than re ready. See the four? You see, you see you walk in and not and people telling you negative. No, you ain't gonna make it. No, you're not gonna do that. No, you're silly for thinking that. Who do you think you are? And then remember I was saying about you walk in, walk in. And the less you're hearing those voices, the quieter those voices, those negative opinions um, that you were hearing. And I told you that you're going somewhere and you're being celebrated, welcomed. That's the six of wands, that's you. Yeah. The star, the six of wands. I don't know what you're doing. I, I love to read your comments. Let me know, please. You're on the right path and you were this person. Some of some people don't realise, you know, the six of wands, you see that person there on the horse. Do you know how much people said, you can't do that or you're not ready to do and all these things? They, they didn't just turn up there and people cheering them on. People are in awe of this person because they overcome a lot of things. That's also, again, somebody in the spotlight, somebody being recognised for something, some sort of victory. Now, for, for all of you will be in different ways. Some of you guys, your, your goal was peace. Some of you guys, your goal was moving away from a toxic environment. However, it, however this resonates for you guys, and even if you're still on that journey, that's what's, what's, that's what's waiting for you there. Okay? 
That's what's waiting for you. Some of you guys, this is more of a spiritual thing, okay? It is more. I, it does feel more spiritual. I'm hearing lessons learned also. You got you. There's a lot. This the six of wands has a lot of stories to tell. Do you know how much they've witnessed? How much they've, they've, they've experienced on their journey? When they get off the horse, they'll probably you know take off their armor, take off all this, and they'll be say people will be saying. So what happened? What happened? How did you do it? Tell us. Some of you guys could be writing a book. Some of you guys could be sharing certain things, okay? The Nine of Swords, the world, you said it wasn't easy. No one said it would be. You knew. You heard it. All those people shouting, Gemini, stop, stop. Be, we'll, come on, no one ever makes it out of here. Or no one ever does this. But you did it. Five of Wands in reverse. You accepted the challenge. <laughs> you were like, what's the point of even trying, trying to compete with these people who are not even... Is, It made no sense to even try to make certain people understand where you're trying to be, what who you're trying to become. It's pointless. What else can you tell me about Gemini, please? The King of Pentacles. That's weird. It's come straight. It's come right under the Queen of Pentacles there. Some of you guys, it really is something that, that what you're going towards. It's something that's going to change your life and make it um, much more stable financially. OK, I'm getting a lot of um, more free time to do things. Some of you guys could have retired. Some of you guys is a thing where maybe you just paid off certain debt. OK, got yourself out of something into a much better position. The three of pentacles. I'm getting something about um, contracts, um, something about uh, what's, what's, the, what's it called? When you... Um, Payment plans, okay, sorting things out financially, getting things in order. It's asking, it's also asking and accepting the help. Page of Pentacles, the Devil, the Three of Swords. Some of you guys had to leave a, a toxic situation, something that's that's really hurt you, whether it's a family thing. Yeah, some of you guys have really ghosted someone or something, something old that wasn't, it was no longer resonating with you. But anything it was like, oh, how do I get out of this? How do I release myself? You've done it by yourself. You've done it. Why did somebody make you think that you were stronger with them and then you realised... That wasn't the case. They needed you more than you needed them. It was it was lies. It was manipulation. Someone needed you more than you needed them. That's why they tried to keep you around, keep you there, whether it's work, a relationship, wherever it is. Okay. You're overcoming a lot of things and I love it. All right. So I'm going to leave that there, guys. And let me do a let me do a um, love reading for you. OK, what's going on in what's going on with Gemini's in regards to their love life, please? The collective of Gemini's. I just heard that Beyonce song. Listen. Oh, OK, that makes sense. What I just said. Oh, my God, that's crazy crazy come on if you know that song then you know the meaning of that song if you, if you haven't listened to that song listen to it because somebody that song that Beyonce sang listen I don't know if it's actually called that but if if you type it in the song the right song will come up okay someone wasn't hearing you somebody was not hearing you why is this coming over to your love reading some of you guys, it is a partner, someone who didn't want you to succeed. 
Okay. Okay, tell me more, please. Seven of Wands, something's being blocked. Something or someone's being blocked. Gemini. Restrictions. The moon. Someone around you, Gemini, has been not themselves. I'm not sure how long how how long of a period this has been with you and this person where this person's just this you, you can't get through to them. You can't get through to them. The Ten of Pentacles, the Ace of Pentacles. So there's a relic. Some of you guys, you're in a relationship with this person. Some of you guys, that was the goal to to be in a committed relationship, to be in a steady relationship. Okay, I'm also getting um something about opportunities that really could have changed your life. Ace of Cups. Oh, all these aces. Okay. The lovers. Some of you guys. All right. If you're a single Gemini, whoever you was dealing with before wasn't meant for you because something much better is coming along. Ten of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Cups and the Lovers. What did I... Was it your reading that I did? Yeah. If it's a past person, guys, there's something new coming towards you, okay? Could be an earth sign, could be a Gemini, could be a water sign. Much more, much more better for you. You're going to be much more calm and much more um, secure in this connection. You're not going to have to wonder about if they love you how they feel about you because they're going to tell you and show you they're going to tell you and show you tell me more please knight of cups person's coming towards you they want to take you out they want to wine and dine you four of swords some of you guys you could have taken a break from dating also some of you guys maybe you haven't seen them in a while the empress some of you, some of you guys may hear about a pregnancy. Okay, you may hear about a pregnancy. Could be a Taurus that you're dealing with. Got Gemini, got Cancer there. The star. I don't know. So for, I don't know if this is for some of you guys. It's a new person. Some of you guys, it's someone that you're currently with. I do see things improving. Ooh, oh, this seems much more serious. Four of Wands. Some of you guys, this could be marriage. If that's something that you were both wanting, something that you're open to. Some of you guys, it could be um, moving in together. But I see things really, really getting better. Got te look, got Ten of Pentacles. Got the Ace of Cups. Lovers. The Four of Wands. The Empress. Yeah. Ace of Pentacles. You may have wanted something with somebody. Maybe the chemistry was strong. Or maybe the adult times was good that you had with this person. I've got to keep it PG. Do you get what I'm trying to say? There's somebody that's more suitable for you that's coming in. Some of you are with them now. Some of you guys, it's coming up. You will be having a conversation with this person. They could be younger than you. Someone, if so, can I just say this? Someone needs someone needs to know that. Um, if someone's done you wrong, they they know they did wrong. They know they did wrong. Yeah, some of you guys are single from somebody who calls you like um stress and you're single from them now but you'll be you're becoming much more successful you'll be getting a lot of attention as well yeah 
Nine of Pentacles and the Six of Wands. A lot of you guys will be getting much more attention now. Three of Cups. Some of you guys are going out more. You're going out more, you know, dressing up, doing, you know, being more social, you will be. People are going to be fighting over you, like, not fighting over you, but kind of like trying to get your attention. You're going to have many different options. I feel like if you're a single uh, Gemini, it's a thing where it could be ex uh, interested in you. There's also going to be new people coming up, okay? I'll say keep open mind. Um, this person may not be your exact type. Don't completely shut them down, okay? That could be a great person for you. Keep open mind. Especially if you if you kind of have a certain type and that's who you tend to go for and it doesn't work out, definitely keep an open mind this time around, okay? All right, guys, I'm going to leave it there. Please like, share, subscribe. If you'd like a personal reading, all the information is in the description. Have an amazing week and I will see you in your next reading. Bye, guys.